So, alpha, beta are the roots of 5x square minus 10x minus 9 equals 0. Formed with the following root. So, we see here. So, x square minus sum of root x plus product of root is equal to 0. Now, we have 5x square minus 10x minus 9 is equal to 0. So, to make it x square, we divide everything with 5 divided by 5. So, we get x square minus negative 9 divided by 5, we get. And this one, negative 9 divided by 5, we get negative 9 over 5 is equal to 0. So, now we have so is equal to 2 so 2 is equal to you see given alpha plus beta this one is alpha plus beta so you see negative 9 over 5 is product of root product of roots negative 9 over 5 is equal to alpha beta now we have alpha plus beta and alpha. okay so for a alpha plus 2 and beta plus 2 so sum of root is equal to alpha plus 2 plus beta plus 2 so we get alpha plus beta plus 4 so we know alpha plus beta is equal to 2 so 2 plus 4 is equal to 6 so product of root is equal to alpha plus 2 times beta plus 2 so we get alpha beta plus 2 alpha plus 2 beta plus 2 times 2 is 4 so we get alpha beta plus 2 alpha plus beta plus 4 now we can substitute alpha beta is equal to negative 9 over 5 plus 2 alpha plus beta is equal to 2 plus 4 so we get is equal to 31 over 5 so x square minus sum of root x plus product of root is equal to 0 so x square minus sum of root is equal to 6 x plus product of root is equal to 31 over 5 is equal to 0. Now, to make it general form, we multiply everything with 5. So, we get 5x square minus 30x plus 31 is equal to 0. B, 5 alpha and 5 beta. So, sum of root is equal to 5 alpha plus 5 beta is equal to 5 alpha plus beta. So, we get 5 alpha plus beta is equal to 2. So, which is equal to 10. So, product of root is equal to 5 alpha times 5 beta, which is equal to 25 alpha beta, which is equal to 25 alpha beta is equal to negative 9 over 5. So, we get negative 45. So, x square minus sum of root x plus product of root is equal to 0. So, x square minus sum of root is equal to 10. x plus product of root is equal to negative 45 is equal to 0. So, it should be x square minus 10x minus 45 is equal to 0. C alpha minus 1 and beta minus 1. So, sum of root is equal to alpha minus 1 plus beta minus 1. So, 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 is equal to alpha plus beta which is equal to 2. So, you see here alpha plus beta is equal to 2 and then product of root is equal to alpha minus 1 times beta minus 1. So, we get alpha beta minus alpha minus beta plus 1. So, we get alpha beta minus alpha plus beta plus 1 is equal to alpha beta. Alpha beta is equal to negative 9 over 5 minus alpha plus beta is equal to 2 plus 1. So, we get negative 14 over 5. So, x square minus sum of root x plus product of root is equal to 0. So, x square minus sum of root is equal to alpha is equal to 2 x plus product of root is negative 14 over 5 negative minus 14 over 5 is equal to 0 so to make it general form multiply everything with 5 5 x square minus 10 x minus 14 is equal to 0 d alpha over 3 and beta over 3 so sum of root is equal to alpha plus 3 
plus beta over 3. So we get alpha plus beta over 3. Product of root is equal to alpha over 3 times alpha times beta over 3. So we get alpha beta over 9. So alpha, alpha plus beta is equal to 2 over 3. Alpha beta is equal to negative 9 over 5 divided by 9 which is equal to negative 9 over 45. So, x square minus so x plus 4 is equal to 0. x square minus so is equal to 2 over 3x plus 4 is negative 9 over 45 is equal to 0. So, 3 over 45, we multiply everything with 45. So, 45 x square minus this one times 45 over 45. We get 15. 15 times 2 is minus 30 x minus 9 is equal to 0. So we see this one can be, everything can be divided by 3. So we get divided by 3, 15 x square minus 10 x minus 3 is equal to 0.